So, okay. I am going to do a what's in my work bag video because again, I only do this like once a workplace pretty much. Um, and I've worked at this place for since April 17th of 2017 and it is now January 9th of 2018 and this is my work bag and this is one of my name tags and it says I don't believe in females it's got a whole bunch of aliens on it I got it from Hot Topic when it was on sale I have a dark mark keychain on it I have a button that says zombies eat brains you're safe I have a hand sanitizer holder with this little skeleton dude on it and a tiny backpack keychain which I had tissues in I need to clean this out it is <laughs> like I know for a fact I need to clean this out therefore here I am and I'm just gonna go from big pocket to the smaller pockets because that seems easier and then maybe this backpack won't be so heavy on my back maybe in my next video you might see that I have completely different hair color I'm fucking hoping um everything I've looked up online about dyeing your hair with pregnancy seems to relay that it's safe and a lot of people bleach their hair so I'm hoping I'm going to talk to my OBGYN tomorrow at my appointment I have a new OBGYN tomorrow and see if she thinks it'll be okay if I dye my hair or I'm pretty sure dyeing my hair will be no issue but bleaching it too because I want to go back to blonde <laughs> and um, if I can uh, my sister helped me tomorrow and it will be completely different and I'll be excited and I'll probably film a hair update video depending so, in the big pocket we have I mean there's no there's no hiding it like I've never been too hidden about it I've just never talked about where I worked and I've kind of worked around saying the exact place in past videos or whatever but I've worked there for over nine months now like there's no point in not talking about it I work at a subway in a Lowe's travel stop here's a subway bandana and that was my hat my visor here's a long sleeve subway shirt which I have in there just in case I'm cold because Pregnancy is weird and I have heat strokes like 98% of the time and it's just, it's just not worth it to put it on and be like dying of a heat stroke. Uh, I have a charger for my cell phone and my wallet because I did work today and I do have, this is the piercing I wear at work. Um, I have my actual like full on cell phone in there and I will change it once I get done with this video. I know my hair looks really bad but... Bear with me, I don't have water right now, but I should be washing my hair tomorrow if I can dye my hair. I'll probably take a shower at my mom's house anyway. I have a little first aid kit. It's a bonus kit from another first aid kit that I have. I bought like three different first aid kits, so. Some mail that needs to be burnt. I have this phone case in here because I want to use it so bad. It's just, I, we still live with my fiance's mother and she's super religious, so I'm not gonna put this on my phone and have her see it just out of respect you know so we can just set that there I have or did I not pack my apron I guess I didn't because it was wet but I don't think I took my name tag off of it so I'm really upset I hope anybody takes my name tag home because it's happened before and I really don't want to have to use this crappy name tag that's stuck to the front because we have like metal ones with our names engraved on them I like those better but anyway I also have a long apron that goes around you which I wear to stick pins on and also when I did overnights I would wear that one uh, when I was cleaning the ovens because you can get stuff all over the shirt and have to wash your shirts more often anyway here's a around the waist apron that we have a bottle of Tylenol well uh well acetaminophen which is what Tylenol is which is safe for you to take while I'm pregnant so I know I have not taken all of this since I was pregnant I've had this bottle for a really long time I have a flashlight, which I could use for, I don't know, does this lighting look better? <laughs> we can we can try it for a hot minute. I have um, another one of these clear nose rings uh, in here as a backup in case I lose this one or I leave my wallet at home for whatever reason. I also have my backup glasses, my new glasses, which are black, and I have them in the glasses sock case, which is what these came from, because this is a really nice case. 
I need to just get another case and keep this one with me if I'm like traveling or you know going swimming or whatever because in the summer you know, obviously you can't swim with your glasses on and I went to the beach and I don't really feel comfortable having my glasses just out in the sand and this is actually a really sturdy box which I would feel pretty pretty safe having my glasses in um like on the beach or whatever or you know near the river I'm not afraid somebody's gonna step on it and break my glasses because there are like clear sleeves or like soft sleeves there's another apron in here and I will say that it is because I leave my backpack open on the floor and these aprons just fall in so I'll just have to remember to take that out tomorrow or well, next time my work is Friday and today is Tuesday so I also have stool softener because I have issues with constipation though I haven't used it in a really long time it's fruit snacks and I hope they're still in date because I just I buy stuff and I throw it in my bag and forget it says great I know my hair looks like absolute crap right now it needs to be washed <sighs> ignore that I have my speaker in here which I think works wonderfully and has been dropped it's had water splashed on it which is it says that it's like drop resistant water resistant or like splash resistant and something else dirt resistant maybe but it's really nice i really recommend it i do the mail and rebate for it so i got 30 dollars back after i bought it so i have a box of craisins i have allergy and sinus pill it's a little pill holder which i did have my tylenol in and i just put the whole bottle in there a dollar probably a tip at some point I have this little ribbon that we we did a, a thing uh, we would ask people for like six weeks if they wanted to donate Children's Miracle Network and I got a ribbon that I did have you know attached to my name tag that stayed on my apron because my name tag stays on my apron on my shirt because I wear the long apron anyway I saved it because I was probably gonna put it in my scrapbook which is actually at the other house that I'm moving to so I'll just have to pack it up and hope it doesn't get lost on the way I have a gray scrunchy type hair bag I have a receipt Kraft mac and cheese at my job it's trash I miss trash can I have this rubber band that I would like to add to my rubber band ball if I could find my rubber band ball but again it could be at the other house I have this tiny orange pin because I got it in a pack of like Halloween pins or whatever for super cheap after Halloween. A <laughs> good thing of gauze, just in case. Another, I have another black pin. I have another, another one of those tiny pins with black. I have a black scrunchie. Probably really old Twix. <laughs> I have a really old uh, Linder ball, chocolate ball that I need to throw away. My iPod in here, which it's dead and it has the auxiliary cord stuck to it because I'll plug it up to my speaker. So I need to charge my iPod for one thing, but I haven't really used it off much often and I need to get songs updated on it. So that's something. I have deodorant just in case I forget to put deodorant on. Yes, I wear Axe. The things from Children's Miracle Network that Max donated, my fiance and wrote camera on and I saved it to put in my scrapbook. And Wow, this light's actually working pretty, pretty darn well. An appointment card, an old appointment card that is trash. Thing from Legoland that says kids go free with a paid adult through August 31st, 2018. So it's still, it's still in, it's still in date, but my kid is not going to be old enough to enjoy Legoland. Uh, I have a green hairband that I had for the holidays, so I need to put it up. I had another black hairband. Yeah price tag from Max's Christmas present because that's the closest that's it was the closest thing I could stick it in without him seeing it uh, I have you, you know from the if you watched the last what's in my bag lifesavers lifesavers I love lifesavers I still have half a bag up there lifesavers <laughs> um a lighter with a skull on it because I I don't smoke but I really like I really like this lighter we burn a lot of candles and I keep a lighter in my bag just in case a friend needs it or whatever but I really like the way this guy do looks he look he reminds me of the uh it word from Frambo uh the snowman pin from Christmas that we hit put on our visors so I'll probably stick that in my scrapbook I have some kind of piece of paper trash another rubber band 
another lighter for whatever reason. This one has an eye on it. I just really like the way some lighters are designed. Therefore, I buy them. Um, another lifesaver. Another lifesaver. It really need to be in a different pocket because it's just in the bottom of the big pocket. But uh, I have some change. I have like a dollar, a dollar and a dime. Another lifesaver. It's not that interesting anymore. <laughs> and three pennies. Another one of those tiny pins. Another quarter. A dime. White scrunchie. Another thing of dollars. Another one of those snowman pins, but this one is not broken, so I can just stick it on anything, really. So I can save it for next Christmas. I have another hair bow in that part, and then I have a section that has mostly pads from when I, you know, still had my period before I was pregnant. And then some liners, which again are very important for when you're pregnant. In my humble opinion, for my body, it's very important. Another type of lid to my bottle, which is back there you can you can see it it's that bottle it's a hydro flask bottle and this is one of the type of lids for it a butt to charge my phone and whatnot it's paper oh yeah this is just a funny piece of paper that i'm not gonna read out loud right i'm not gonna read out loud right now maybe one day probably stick it in my scrapbook so if i ever go through my scrapbook it'll be wide lifesaver the scrunchie yeah green scrunchie um stomach relief pill yeah, and that's all in the big pocket and in the front pocket is a whole lot of pins and stuff so we've got this had a uh, hair bows on it purple pin pink pin pink highlight extra gum orange orange highlighter purple pinkish fuchsia sharpie green pink purple sharpie pink sharpie drink mix has caffeine. yellow sh uh highlighter green another green pin gray sharpie those tiny pins because i just stuck them in the front a purple pin another hair bow a blue sharpie blue highlighter is a sharpie highlighter box cutter mm, my old Oh goodness, <laughs> the bottom's broken and my uh, fingers on them. bag. Uh, protect your fingers if you have handbags on. Another hair bow. Another hair bow. Blue pin and a blue sharp. Another hair bow. My cat playing with the uh, holiday pin and knocking my trash in the floor. Bluish pink fuchsia pin. That's all the pins. So I can stick all these back in my bag. Hair bow. It's a Canadian nickel. It's another Canadian nickel. A hair bow to try in that pocket and this was something I couldn't look at at the time oh yeah this was an example of my task list for third shift when I did overnights I had this box cutter when I worked at Renfro side pocket and it's the uh, netting type pocket I have chapstick honey sticks they're probably bad by now because I forgot about them crazen box sucker and a whole chapstick and a whole lot of lifesavers so that's all that's in my work bag i hope you enjoyed i think this video might be a little bit longer than the last one i could be wrong i'm about to take that away from my cat i hope it's not bothering you too bad have a good night <laughs>